What's up YouTube, Northwest Farm Dad here. Today, let's talk about straw hats and more specifically American Hat Co. straw hats. So uh, if you look here, you got three hats. The one on the left is my old beat up resist all. I've worn that around the farm for the last couple of summers. Uh, it's now sort of my tractor outside work and sweating hat. In the middle is an American Hat Co. hat that I bought for my daughter that was just a little bit too small for her, but I own it because it's custom shaped. And then you've got my brand new, just got it today, American Hat Co. straw hat. So let's look at the two American Hat Co. hats specifically, and I'm going to talk about the retailers that I purchased them from because I was actually happy with both of them. So let's get down to business. All right, so first things first. Uh, bought this hat from Botas Rogeros down in Texas. Uh, my daughter had been wearing a six and three quarters. Unfortunately, her head grew, so she's now six and seven eighths. So I own this one because she wanted a custom shape on it. Uh, and I think they did a really nice job of shaping it. She also wanted some uh, particular colors and they had it in stock. From a packaging perspective, it arrived in great shape. Um, and I'm just happy with uh, the overall hat. One thing to note that I really like about American Hat Company hats is they make um, what's called a long oval hat. All right, so you can see right there, there's the size, the six and three quarter, and then it shows that it's a long oval. So both my daughter and I have, I guess, long heads. So we're kind of, we're more narrow, uh, uh, just like a less round head. American Hat Company is one of the few straw hat companies that makes a long oval hat hat, which uh, I very much appreciate because it helps me find a much better fitting hat. Um, but yeah, overall, uh, a really, really nice hat. Um, and I think my daughter's going to be very happy with this. So for mine, I wanted a much simpler, just standard straw um, with some venting, uh, typical cattleman's crown. Um, again, uh, I ordered uh, the long oval. If you're on most of the websites, it'll uh, delineate a long oval with an L-O, or in the description of the hat, it will say long oval. So there are different models that are long ovals. Um, and uh, it just helps fit my head a lot better. Uh, I like the overall construction of the hat. The stitching is clean. Um, you know, ultimately I was able to pick the uh, band uh, color and then it comes with four sort of accessories. Uh, it's got the American Hat Co. Um, clasp there. It's got the um, pin there and then it has the two um, patches, the TX or the Plus X. Uh, both of those are coming off. Uh, I do not feel that anybody needs to know what brand my hat is. I think it's sort of too bougie for me. Uh, I'm not a 20 year old that needs to keep stickers on his hats. So those will come off. I will keep the more subtle um, pin and um, the clasp, but uh, those are coming off. Um, so I bought this one from uh, the Best Hat Co. in Fort Worth, Texas. Um, I ordered it. It took about a week to get here. Um, I think what I was most happy about just from a packaging perspective is this is the box that it came in. So I had the American Hat Co. box inside a box and then, you know, you're spending some decent money on a hat. Uh, it, it's just really well packaged with the plastic liner. You've got the foam. Then there was the other insert, you know, box in a box. Um, I've gotten hats in the past where they just shipped the hat box with a label on it. Um, but this really gives it a lot of um, durability and shipping when they when they ship stuff like this. So overall, um, it fits really well for my long oval head. Uh, and I am super pleased uh, with the construction quality um, and these uh, these two hats. So anyhow, if you like my stuff, please like and subscribe and I'll keep posting more content. Thank you.